foot eight and 210 pounds. This one bounces all the way to the backstop. That's gonna allow both runners to move up and we're tied at one. So the control con issues for Gonzalez continue and they blow up in this one as Rodriguez comes across with a fight and run that ties it up at 1-1. Scoreboard that's part of the upgrades here at the stadium. 2-2 two -two pitch lifted into center field. Back goes Roman Anthony still going back to the track and makes the catch slamming into the fence. Runner will tag up Rinconis and they're going to wave him in as Anthony is shaken up and Gabriel Rinconis will come across with a go ahead run. Roman Anthony with a great catch as he ran into the fence and then was hurt. And some heads up base running and coaching by the Fightins as they as Rinconis tags up and he fists it to the right side is through for a base hit. Kendall Simmons will score. And Rodriguez will round second and head to third base. So Marcus Lee sang with an RBI single. It's now a four to three game. This one lifted into left center field. Nick York going back, still going back, looks up and says goodbye. Carson Taylor finds the left center field fence for the home run and the Fightins are within one at 5-4. Second home run of the season for Carson Taylor. Right field. This one fisted into the hole and in for a base hit. Padri Al Padrique waving Simmons around. The throw is going to be cut off. They'll have a play at second. And Robert Moore is tagged out, but he gets the run across. That run will score and it will tie the ball game up. So it'll go as an RBI single for Robert Moore. And Kendall Simmons comes across with the run that ties the ball game up after three. Driven into left center field, turn and say goodbye. Jose Rodriguez deep to left center field. It's an eight to six ball game. This one ripped into right field, turn and say goodbye. Carson Taylor lands it on the porch on the Redner's Event Center and the fight fills have taken a 9-8 lead.